Hi, it's Mr. Dang. I'll be showing you how to set an auto height property for controls that don't normally have auto height. I'm going to be inserting a text input field on top of a label. The label is going to be set to whatever text is inside that. So I set it to text input one dot text. The label itself, I'm going to configure it so that auto height is true. I go back to my text input field and I want to set its height to the same thing as label one, label one dot height. As the height of label one changes, so does the height of the text input field. I'm going to make this text input field multi-line. Let's test it out. Put in some text. The quick brown fox jumps over the lazy dog. Copy paste that a few times. It works. What happens if I delete it? Oh, it becomes kind of slim. I could fix that by setting a minimum height. I'm actually going to be using the maximum function to do this. This means it's going to be at least 70 pixels high. And there it goes again. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more interesting power apps, please subscribe.